Recently in my classroom, I had, to me, a profound aha moment. Um, it really, this, this moment helps clarify for me why what we do is really important. Um, a young man approached me and said that a friend of his had said something very mean to him. And um, clearly this boy was upset, very upset. Um, and I said to him, you know, gosh, you know, I can see that you're upset. Is there, is there something that you want to do about this? Do you want to take an action step about this? Or do you want to think about it? So, you know, wh where are you with this? And he said, I want to do something about it. And I said, okay, well, let's analyze what are some of the options that you have to, to do about this? And he said, well, I could go tell him how it made me feel. And I said, okay. And we actually wrote down, number one, you can go tell him how you feel. And he said, I can go find out why he said that to me. And I, okay, you can go find out why he said that to you. So you can seek more information. All right, you can do that. Um, I said, you could retaliate. And he looked at me and I said, isn't that, isn't that a choice that you have? I mean, you could retaliate and go say something mean back to him. I said, I'm not, I'm not telling you you should, but I'm just saying we're just really listing all of our options here. Um, and so I wrote down, he said, uh, yeah, I guess I could. And so then we talked through what do each of these mean for you and what do they mean for this other person and for your community? And he chose to go seek more information. Well, in seeking more information, eh, it turns out that maybe when this other boy said something mean, this one in particular had been maybe not doing some kind things himself. And he was able to come back and go, oh, I know now why he said this to me. I was doing this. And okay, so did seeking more information work for you? And yeah, it did. okay, now I understand, great. Well, that wasn't actually the profound moment for me. The profound part was recognizing that each of these children and as adults, we do have the opportunity to retaliate, to hit someone, to say something mean back, to do something negative. We always have that choice. I have choices right now in what it is that I'm saying and how I say it. And to recognize that really our work is helping children see what all of these options are and helping them pick the one that works for them and works for their community. And so for that boy to respond to me with, well, retaliate, that doesn't sound like something you'd usually say. And for me to recognize we're constantly working to make choices that are opposite of that or different than that. And for him to see too that, huh, I do have power in this. I'm choosing not to retaliate. That, that, that was an aha moment for me.